and I want to share with you how, why, and what we'll be doing. The three questions I always ask myself whenever I'm deciding what project to do next or what place to go are, where can I learn and grow the most? Where can I make the biggest impact? And where do I feel called or compelled to go? It's a mix of inspiration and also just receiving guidance and being like, this is where I can make the biggest impact. So last year when I was in Greece, I met someone and we got chatting, I told him what I did and he said that I should go to Portugal because there are tons of awakened alternative communities there. And that thought kept coming back to me and percolating in my mind over the last year. Then a couple of weeks ago, I ended up Skyping a girl who's been to a place called the Mercaba community in Portugal. And the more that I looked them up and even Skyped the owner, the more that I knew that this is the place. This is the place that I wanted to go to start this next chapter of our journey. I also specifically wanted to visit alternative communities and to share their visions and how they work with you guys because I get a lot of questions from people who want to do what I do but don't know how to get started. And honestly, when I started, I didn't know anyone who did this, but it was through the process of plugging into different communities that I ended up making incredible friends and now I've got talented friends all around the world who are like my sisters and I know that if stuff ever hit the fan they would let me crash at their place indefinitely and we'd figure it out together and knowing that I have that support means the world to me and it's one of the things that gives me the courage to keep going and I want you guys to have that support as well but my friends might not be able to host all of you guys who follow me here online in their own homes, but that's why I created ProjectSoulFam.com. Project Soul Fam is a hub, it's a resource, it's a place for our tribe to connect, for us to build things together and collaborate. And I want to make tons of resources for you guys to share the ins and outs of how I do this so that if you wanted to, you know that you could do it too. And the awesome thing about me visiting communities is that I'm going to be able to build a reliable database so that if you wanted to visit the exact same place that I did, or if you wanted to go to Portugal and find a place that you could just live and work on your craft for three months at a time, you could. And it'll be a place that I have literally lived in or a place that I can vouch for and that I know is good and is solid. I'm really excited for this because it'll be like creating a trail for you guys that if you wanted to take a break from your job and just work on your craft and do what it is that you love and find your new direction for time, you could go to these places and be surrounded by incredibly inspiring travelers and fellow creators and artists and entrepreneurs of every kind. So that is Project Soul Femme. I'd love for you guys to check out the website. Let me know what you think. And if you're interested in getting more involved, definitely message me through there. I'm always open to collaboration. I'm so excited for what's next for us in Portugal. Although I've loved my time here in Toronto, it's gonna be nice to get out of the suburbs and back into mother nature and to capture some incredible footage for you guys in Portugal and to make tons of travel films and beautiful yoga films. But every time I know that I'm leaving, it's like, ah, oh, this is why life is so precious. I'm gonna be leaving Toronto in two weeks and capturing the whole thing for you guys. I've already got things in the works for after Portugal, but we'll save that for later. And I just can't wait to share this whole journey with you guys. I love you so much, and this is gonna be awesome. Mwah.